Alright, guys, we're continuing on. For some reason, Makideta is in a ferociously excited state. Ryudo gazed frankly and coldly at the noisy Makideta, who just barged into the room. だから大変なんだって。だから大変だというのは大胆な省略だな。マキには携帯を使うとかメールを打つとかそういう捨てはお思いつかないのか。そんなことはどうでもいい。行くぞ。She roughly grabs onto my sleeve. Perhaps it was my sleeve's fate to be grabbed onto here in the student council room. Behind us, I can hear Ryudo say, Makidera, I don't recall allowing you to call me the son of the temple either, but I've already been dragged away. Recklessly running through the hallways doesn't really agree with me, but I cannot be helped with Makideta in this state. As I try to keep up with her, I glance at Makideta's face. <laughs> Why does that expression of hers make me feel so uneasy? We stop and cut off our voices. Is there something around the corner of this hallway? Oh. Mitsuzuri Ayako and Emiya Shiro are near the stairwell. Strange. What is this pair that I was just thinking about in the student council room doing here? Here we go with the misunderstandings again. Just as Yukika says, the two of them were talking openly with each other. It was quite a contrast compared to the thorny atmosphere during the conversation between Miss Tosaka and Emiya on the roof that was clear even from far away. Emiya's face is an open book like usual, but how should I describe Mitsuzuri-san? Because they're friends? I speak frankly. Although not as much as Tosaka, Mitsuzuri Ayako usually wears an angry expression more often than a smile. But the way she talks with Emiya and even slaps his back is not her usual self. Yukika's expression is troubled. That's only natural. Rather, it would be a problem if it didn't paint our heart eavesdropping on the private lives of Miss Tosaka and Miss Mitsuzuri like this. For a deeply kind natured Yukika, this must be torture. And Makideta is just standing there with sparkling eyes and no sign of being troubled by this in the least. This is one big problem. And you would be right with that assumption, Himuro. Akidera looks back with a puzzled expression. 
But before I could answer, the scene occurring down the hall changes. Oh. Mitsuzuri walks down the stairs smiling. Emiya heads this way. Are we going to have to run away again? Panic sets among us. But we won't make it in time. Mm -hmm. It's rare when you can see Shiro like this because we're always playing from his POV. Emiya glances curiously at us and then continues on his way. Silently without a word from him or us. <sighs> Yukika finally heaves a sigh of relief. Now that Emiya and Mitsuzuri are gone, even I feel such a strong sensation of both tension and relaxation that I want to loosen my collar. Makideta's shoulders shake as she smiles suspiciously. You mean them conversating? Because that's standard. Yeah, I regret having fallen behind Makideta. No, it was not entirely fruitless. Makideta asks if she has just remembered it. It's not a topic I should bring up now, but it is also not a secret. リュウドウに直談判をしていた三津釣りと付き合っているのかと。how troublesome. Although the circumstances around Mitsuzuri have become complicated, both Ryodo and Makidera have been creating chaos and confusion inside my head. I wish they would follow Yukika's example. She's truly quiet, kind, and cooperative. I try to imagine a quiet, kind, and cooperative Makidera. And immediately give up on doing so. By this couple, she could only mean one thing. Mitsuri Ayako and Emiya Shiro. Maki-chan, maybe... So, Emiya and Mitsuri, right? Akideta appears to be genuinely happy. But even so, it does not seem quite right. This whole thing smells like trouble. どうだろう。エミヤは元弓道部で三津釣り城はエミヤに随分異流工作をしていたと聞く。やめた後でも腹部を働きかけていたというな。The legend of the tiger Fuyuki told about in rumors is more like some kind of a cult horror story though. Getting back to the main topic. とにかく、旧道部をエミヤが辞めても、三津釣り城との接点はあったわけだ。あの台の副部長が信じたもんな。私が三津釣りだったとしたら、同じことしたくなるよ。ましてよ。エミヤがうまいとなれば、ますます。
でもミツズリがしていたのは遺留工作じゃなくて男女のアプローチだったってことかおかしいよマキちゃんそれだったらその遠坂さんより先に。Yukiko says is quite right. If Miss Mitsuzuri and Emiya started dating around the time he quit the club, then it wouldn't be strange for it to have gotten out by now. Furthermore, that would mean Miss Tosaka cut in from the side and stole Emiya. If that happened, the relationship of the two, no, the three of them, would have inevitably worsened. But the circumstantial evidence rejects that. I have not heard anything about Miss Mitsuzuri and Miss Tosaka becoming estranged from each other, and Mitsuzuri's strange in behavior was first seen in the beginning of spring as well. In other words, Miss Tosaka was dating Emiya first. This is certain. Oh, so da na. Do you k o t o n a n d a k o r e a Muzukashi ga, Mikutsuga wa nai wa kere wa nai. So da na. You mean that they're just friends? Yeah. I motion towards the two with my hands. Precisely arranging the three of us into an equilateral triangle. What is it, Kaneta? Tatoeba, what is it, Yukika to Makinojiga, Tokan Kakuni Hanarete Tato Sur? Kore de Doda? Yeah, do more shinaike do sa. Anyo, so there. The two tilt their heads in confusion, wondering what was about to happen. Dewa, go shita to s u r What? I step sideways and stand right behind Yukika, and then gently embrace her around the waist. <laughs> okay. Nani suru no? Kane cha! Do da, Makinoji. Ima no shinkyo o arite ni itte miru ga i. なんかすごく悔しい気がするんだけどな。Within my arms, Yukika struggles, but I can only apologize in my mind. I want to continue the explanation while, this, while in this position, but I can't since the people around us are starting to stare. I release my hands and free Yukika. そういうことだ。なあ、変なことをしてすまなかったな、Yukika。つまり先ほどのマキデラをミツズリ城ユキカをエミヤ私を遠坂城として考えてほしい。Are they assuming this is a love triangle? <笑>当初3人はほぼ等間隔の正三角形。いやエミヤと遠坂の間は極度に離れた二等辺三角形だったこの状態ではお互い心理的に何ら波風は立ちようがない I form a triangle with my fingers to demonstrate both Makidera and Yukika nod as they follow along あの状態では何も思いようがないね単なる友人だからでもカネちゃんがしたみたいにだが、三つずり城の前で友人であった遠坂城とエミヤ四郎が交際するという事態が発生する。Really、<笑>そうなると、マキデラの位置にいた三つずり城はやおら孤立することになる。そうなれば彼女は自然と。ミツズリにしてみれば悔しくもあるよなそれまでエミアが好きだったかどうかは置いといても取られちゃったわけだから悔しいというかそこで初めてエミアが恋愛対象となりうる男性であったと気がついたというところかそうなるとミツズリ城は嫌でもエミア城を意識することになる今までの接触も帯びている色合いが変わってくる 
I stopped here to observe Makideta and Yukika's expressions. And judging that the details of my story have settled in, I continue. むしろ盗作場の交際が始まってからこそ密釣り場とエミアの交際の可能性が発生する。You're the moment my explanation ends, a cheerful Makidera shout of joy comes out. Three cushions, she says. In other words, she must be hinting that I have been overdoing it. It is vexing, but I cannot deny it. With the hurdle now clear, there is a great contrast between the delighted Makidera and Yukika. It pains me to see Yukika without a smile. But... Although I had intended to find out Mitsuri's significant other, I ended up prying into someone else's love triangle before I knew it. In addition to that, I am a third party just out to satisfy my own curiosity. Although it is a bit late, I begin to hate myself. But there is one person not here for their own curiosity that is re reveling in having gained a personal advantage. そういう言い方はあんまり良くないよ、マキちゃん。うん。でもな、これを遠坂が知ればどう思うことか。ねえ。うん。Why is she so giddy about this? It looks like even being rebuked by Yukika could not keep her loose lips in check. As with the time discussing Ryodo, Makidera's interests are centered around Tosaka. She will say something about using Tosaka since it has come to this. Although it seems like she says this sort of thing every day. <笑>それは私に惚れるとやけどするぜ。私に惚れれば投書を追うぞ。名は太陽を表すというからな。<笑> それはさておき。面倒なことになった。ま、遠坂とエミアは喧嘩してるし、エミアと三つずりは<笑> This time, I am avoiding hearing the story directly from those involved. In what way could I intervene and expose this delicate love triangle between men and women to the surface? <laughs> Makideta's agitated gaze pours onto me. しかし <laughs> With Ryodo Ise now the question, no one else comes to mind. But from the most unexpected place, standing alone, Yukika mutters. Yukiko. エミア君のこと、ちゃんと確かめたい。そうじゃないと、遠坂さんが。そうだな。ここまでやったからには、きちんと確かめる。しかし、ユキコ。
Could there be anyone we know that meets such criteria? <clears throat> Of course, you go to her of all people. A roar that resounds all the way to the corners of Miyama. As though having heard the roar of a fighter jet, it is a miracle. That I did not faint from my eardrums being torn. <laughs> Rather than a voice, it was a massive air expelled to the limit of her lung capacity. The lens of my glasses rattled. You're making Shiro's situation a lot worse, Fujine. You really are. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, Fujine. Wanna ease up a little bit? Ectoplasma, Hakanai de Kudasai Sensei. Imano Akuma de Stimundis. Kakuni o Toritaino, Watashi de Atte. I come Fujimura Sensei as she rides around in a fit of hyperventilation. As I thought, should we have passed on probing this person? <sighs> to remember, I take a few steps back in the chronological order. The name that left Yukika's lips was Fujimura Sensei. This was a blind spot indeed. Along with being the supervisor of the archery club, I hear she is like an older sister to Emi Ashiro. Moreover, it's said that she even has a relationship with Miss Tosaka. However, although she is easy to approach, we cannot inquire of such matters at school. And so, we decided to wait for her to leave school in order to stop her off campus and ask for her story. At that time... Oh, Kimuro-san and Makidera-san. And Saigusa-san. Konnichiwa. Konna tokoro de aru no wa mezurashii wa yo ne. Minna hachi no hou de shou? Kaeri michi issho na no? え、私に相談があるの。うーん、まあ、みんなの頼れる藤村先生だから聞いてあげましょう。何何勉強とか友人関係とかいじめは良くないよ。憎しみに憎しみで答えることほど、みっともないことはないんだから。And so, it started out well enough, but え、白のこと? あ、まあ、そこまで言うのなら、まあ、シロのことはよく知ってるからね。ミツデリさん、トウサカさんも？And so the mood. <clears throat> there it is. It's like a tea kettle about to pop. Change into. Something like this. Did the conversation take a wrong turn at some point? So you are not attached at the Uda Stilto, so no Chishironi Paka to Yaratayo. Why are you blaming Shiro for this? Emi Anika Soitua Soreva Goendio Negaimus. <laughs> I think Kiritsugu is applauding his son. 
Fujimura Sensei is in a considerable state of confusion. I give up. Where do I go from here? No, maybe I should calm her down first. She points ahead and the gate of the Emiya residence comes into view. He resides in such a samurai-like residence. An interesting discovery. I see. If the grounds are this, to this extent, it would not be unusual for there to be other cohabitants. No, that Miss Tasaka and Miss Mato are residing here is definitely strange. Putting that aside, this tale will not proceed if we do not calm Fujimura Sensei, who is at the peak of her excitement. I soothe her by patting her shoulders with both hands while thinking, this is the behavior of someone who is our elder and superior? <laughs> Was it this misunderstanding that caused her to make such an uproar until now? Staring blankly, my pace falters for just a moment. Yukika asked while I scolded Makideta. Fujimura sensei, who had been enraged until now, calmed down instantly and is now in deep thought as though puzzled. そうね。確かに言われてみれば素人三鶴さんは友人ではあるけども男女交際関係はって言われればそりゃ難しいわよね。いや、証拠はあるんだけど。どれどれ？どんな証拠？先生にキャッチアンドリーク？ Appearing keenly interested, Fujimura Sensei draws up next to Makideta. I have a feeling these two might get along well, but it will be troublesome if they advance this discussion at their own convenience. I cut it in towards the expectant Sensei. Shoukotoyu I suppress my bubbling dissatisfaction. Having heard the only piece of evidence, Fujimura Sensei goes deep into thought. Hmm? I glanced subtly, examining Fujimura Sensei's expression. She smiled as though a bit troubled from being relied upon, but her expression gradually becomes more unclear. It's as though she's looking not at us, but beyond to somewhere distant. With the graceful behavior since a moment ago, and this current feeling of isolation, it's difficult to think of this as the same Fujimura Sensei. Mm, Mitsuzuri-san-to-shiro-ga-tsukiyatte-ru-tte-yu-no-wa-nai-n-ja-nai-ka-na. She starts laughing as though trying to gloss it over. I experienced neither distress nor relief when she said that we were wrong. I merely think, ah, is that so? As though indifferently watching something get washed away before my very eyes.
もともとシロは女の子相手は得意じゃないから今でもしっちゃかめっちゃかなんだけどね